Good morning to all. Thank you very much for the continuous support in uh, viewing our channels. Today topic is going to be Gada Yogam. Gada Yogam, if the two and nine lots, second, second house lot and ninth house lot having Parivardhana and uh, Lagnadipati in Kendra or Kona, this Yogam will arise. The result is going to be they are all going to be highly fortunate. They will do good in education, and they will be ha they will be having a healthy life. So all the sutras and all we could not be able to memorize the sutras and all. In our team, we have been decoding the sutras into the numerals. Now we will go to the illustrated examples. Seventh house, Rahu placed. In ninth house, Mercury, Saturn, Moon placed. In the tenth house, Taurus, Ragnadipati in tenth house. Sun placed in Taurus. In the eleventh house, Mars, Venus, Mars and Venus placed in Gemini. Now we can go to the rule now. If the Two and nine lords having Parivartana. Here the Lagna is going to be Leo Lagna. Second house lord is Mercury. Ninth house lord is Mars. So Mars and Mercury having Parivartana here. And the Lagna Adipadi in Kendra or Kona. The Lagna Adipadi in Kendra. Lagna Adipadi sun occupies in Taurus, Kendra Stana. So, the result is going to be, they are all going to be highly fortunate, happy, healthy life and they will do good in education also. They have done uh, B.Tech, after that they have finished uh, MBA in Finance. Particularly, the rule exactly matches over this chart. So, if you are having any doubts, please post your comments. Thank you very much for the continuous support in viewing our channels. See you again. Thank you.